I actually wonder how uh, speed runs of this game are gonna go. Mind you, I think I, I think I remember Lobos Jr. talking about wanting to speed run this game at one point. But I feel um, towards the end of, end of the game, his opinion on on it wasn't anywhere near as warm. Oh, cheeky boy! Yeah, look at that, just burning away at him at a pretty accelerated pace. Elements. Gotta love them. Okay, so... I guess the best way to deal with you is a grenade launcher. But I'm worried... Yep, yeah, that's what I was worried about. The uh, other snipers catching me. Oh, you've... Ow. Yeah, this is this is uh, what I feared. But if I can get close to them, I shouldn't have much to worry about. There we go. Look at that skill. I say as I get absolutely assaulted. Oh, okay. That's fine. No, it's not. Oh, that's okay. Yay! I think his shotgun actually had five shells just like mine did. Burnt tongue. Oh no, are you okay? Why did you burn your tongue on? Wait, maybe. There might be an option here. Maybe I'll be able to take care of them from a range. That's pr pr oh shit! Well, I can take a fair few shots, but you know, that's not quite the point, is it? Well, you know, yes, yes, yes. No. Well, you actually do a fair bit of damage. You do. I mean. He is kind of a pushover when you get close to him. He does bugger all damage and all that. But yeah, we should be pretty good now that they're dealt with. The flamboyant architecture, the prime halls of discourse, were meant to give visitors a sense of their insignificance. Well, the former twats. Oh dear. Well, what were the, these uh, noms you've been having? I'm very curious because I'm hungry. Go away. I think you can actually get headshots with the uh, the melee weapons, which will be quite interesting, I must say. Hmm, that seems quite ineffective. Although it's a shotgun, it's meant to be. Oh, you cheating little wanker! Fuck off. Yeah. Feel the wrath of my pink decker. And now he smells like lavender. Uh, yeah. Just get TRM syringe, that's a much safer option. Now, I'm more, I'm more worried about the, uh, the melee guy sneaking up on me than the big boy. The big boy is easy to avoid. The melee guy, he can sneak up on me quite easily. Hello! Oh dear, has an animation broken? Oh my god, it has. Oh, okay. Nope, nope, it's definitely broken. <laughs> oh, you stupid knob. Look at that. I mean, at this, at this rate, he might, might as well be T-posing. I'm actually surprised he isn't. Well, that's a little bit entertaining, isn't it? Uh, Pseudocompany... Yeah, do that. Not really, don't do that actually, you probably don't have a case. Play thing called... Oh! Oh my god, something actually happened! You're right. Well, he doesn't seem too interested in fighting me. Masaka. Ah. Interesting. I don't think I've ever actually had that myself. 
Well, time to put him out of his misery. He lived just as he died. A clueless dick. Now. Aha! That's uh, way more effective than the than the stinky guns. Maybe these need upgrading? They are uncommon, so they probably are kind of losing power. Oh yeah, I got more grenade launcher. Oh! What a good time for uh, more boomage. Yay! I did, a, I did a thing. Okay, yeah. And now this should be the the boss room? Yes it is! Wow, I remember this uh, level being way longer and way harder. Well, I ain't complaining. I'm not complaining at all. The centuries Malog has suffered under the watchful gaze of the Prime. Imprisoned but never forgotten, he has fostered his rage and grows more powerful with each passing day. Skeleton protocol. Wait, I think I might know what that is. Yes, I'm pretty sure I know precisely what that is. And after we beat the boss, you'll probably find out. And you'll be like, what? Maybe. You might be like that, or you'll probably, probably be like, what is this shit? One of those two reactions, I don't know which though. Oh, that is so shit. I can open that though. Oh, Moonbeam, that's a good pistol, but it uses special scaling so he can fuck off. Ugh. Special, special people get all the good stuff. Don't take that out of context. Mercy, some people can take it with them when they go, or at least parts of it. Uh, boosh. Keep some of your bits when dying. Uh, I guess that would be really useful if you, um, hmm. I mean, it is useful, definitely. It's just kind of a little bit bizarre. Way longer and way harder. Oh. You know me very well. Crude. Ew. Yeah, look at that special scaling. Fucking hell. Like, people that go into Insight, god, they they get so much special treatment. It's unfair. There's dicks. Twats. But yeah, we'll just have to get rid of it. Bye-bye, Moonbeam. Oh, I'm pretty sure this is actually the one below Moonbeam as well. But I do get stuff like the Imperial Ballistas. I like those. Those are good guns. Um, I do think think it's probably time to. Oh wait, the uh, yeah, these are perfect. Perfect. Uh, fa, 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 fa. yeah, that's perfect as well. Oh yeah, we didn't try this, did we? Uh, let's have a look at that as well. Oh, new toys to play with! Yeah, it's just kind of a bit more like the gun we already had, really. But it's got a grenade launcher. Boom! So if you don't want to really invest in a grenade launcher, you can put some points into Insight and just get a rapid-fire grenade launcher like that. They are a bit weaker than the uh, normal grenade launchers, but you know, it's still an option, which I, I like. I quite like that. You know, I'm kind of tempted to go for this and change out my, um, the Berserker Glaives. So at least this way I've got another source of acid. Try, uh, try saying that to the police. Yeah. That's a little bit weaker than the one I've already got. So I might want to use this to sort of make comparisons. Yeah, that can piss off. Cron Trebuchet. It's okay. Not great though. Making a no con. 
Oh goodness, imagine that. I would feel famous. Very, very famous. Special people get all the, all the good stuff. Oh dear, god that was Dark Craven. Wow. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> uh, I guess... I mean, energy is pretty good. But yeah, I mean, that's kind of better. Uh, wait, hold on. That says it's burst. Why does that say it's burst? Hold on, hold on. I've got to investigate this. Huh? I guess it was referring to that. Fair enough, I guess. So it's like a single shot, and then it's just a uh, unleash hell. Uh, the the uh, I call this the stinky poo gun. Oh yeah, I still need to try this out. God, you tardy fuck. The the for some reason the uh, the ammo capacity is really low. But maybe that that's different on other compact guns that we might find. But it does it is very accurate. And it seems to do quite a bit of damage. And that like, reload time is pretty good too. So I might give it a go. Oh wait, I forgot to change that. Oh pardon me, sorry. That was a big old burpee. We'll probably use the shotgun on this boss. That might be a better uh, better option, I think. But I guess we'll sort of try this out as well, because I am I am curious. I am very very curious. Oh shit! We ran, ran out of basic components. Oh no! Well, I guess uh, I guess we'll just get rid of these. Yeah, let's just get rid of a load of stuff. That might be the better idea. I'll keep that. Um, I keep those. Now these weapons. Yeah, I guess I'll just get rid of that as well because it's special scaling. So no. Cron shivs. I need very high thingy for that, but I do want to keep them. Alabaster Punisher. It's good. It is good. Yeah. But I feel this would be better. Because we already have like two sources of acid damage anyway. You know? But I don't know. It, it's, it's... You kind of just want to hold on to it and see what, what you can get out of it. Yeah, I can get rid of this now. It has been quite good to me but I'm afraid you have to go. Yeah, get rid of that as well. Uh, Captain Saber. Yeah, as if I'm going to get that much insight. Fuck off. I mean, insight is a great stat to have. It really is. It is just not the stat I'm going for. <laughs> you know, it's just not my build. Guess we can get rid of a load of ass. Oh no! Yeah, material. Reduce weapon spread. Yeah, these are all good. Get rid of that, get a load of uh, one basic component. Are you having a giggle, mate? Steve's looking tired. Yeah, for some reason the, the, the basic idol animation is just them hunching their back over like some sort of silverback gorilla. Just half expecting them to start going... <laughs> And that is your daily animal sound of the day. <laughs> I know, right? It is a long game. Like you, you get a lot of a, a lot of content out of this game, and almost all of it is great. You know, good stuff for a literal Dark Souls shooter. I know, right? What a cool dude. Doesn't even need sustenance. Fix your build info. Oh god, duh. No. <laughs> Don't 
to put it bluntly. Yeah, oh wow. Look, look at that. That is impeccable. It's so good, so amazing that I cannot have it. No. We, we're, we're all about skill in this house. Uh, Dragoon. An additional bit. Yeah, that, that can kind of go away, I guess. Well, I don't know. That would be good for farming, I guess. But we're not going to be farming, so... Uh, I guess I'll keep it on me. In case we ever do do that new game plus uh, run in like two years. <laughs> so, whatever, I guess. Take reduced damage. I mean, the whole point really is to not take damage, so, uh, no. <laughs> Increase melee damage. That would be very good for my build. Eh. Maybe. Gain damage, yeah. I mean, that's good, but... You oh, wow, didn't even give me a basic component there. What a stingy fuck. Yeah, I don't really need those. Don't really need that one. God, stop being so stingy, you piece of shit. Eh, uh, nah. Frost damage, eh. Uh, wow, so stingy. Fucking hell. Increase the stamina recovery. Maybe that's okay? Maybe. Medium range. Pfft. Bloody hell, not even giving me one. Increases damage, 5%, it's not very significant. You stingy twat, I swear. I oh, know, right? 3 damage reduction, like Jesus Christ. Lazy, yeah you are. Alright Muff Gab. Thank you for stopping by, good night. Uh, I think it's gonna be uh, mostly me and Craven now. You sexy boy. No, not really. Kappa Pride. Um. Uh, hmm. Maybe I'll upgrade this. Let's have a look at our weapons first. I can definitely use uh, advance on both of these. I've got more advanced components than basic components, so you know. I guess we'll take the plunge. Oi. Oi. Dickhead. But I am I am uh, going to have to be a little bit careful here. A shotgun is good. But I do like this shotgun quite a lot. Um Yeah. We do get more scaling. Right. I guess we'll sort of leave them like that. I don't think I need to upgrade that right now. Attributes. Wait, I can just uh, pop a load of bits. Yeah, that's a good idea. Oh, bosh. Uh, don't you love doing this in, so in Souls Lakes or just Dark Souls in general? Man, it makes me hard in my pants. All the squelching going on my hands. I probably just turned away literally two people right now. I'm so sorry. <laughs> Goodness gracious, you get so much. You get so much on your face. Oh god. Okay. Uh, I'm. I don't really know where to go with my build from here, but I guess we'll just go into strength for now. That might be a good idea. And I guess we'll probably put some points into a little bit of perception. Maybe a bit into toughness. I guess that's okay. Yeah. Yeah, that'll do. Why not? Be agile as fudge. I would. But, um... I was going to go into compact guns, but... Getting them is so... 
difficult because they're so rare. The high seat of the prime, the thrones of Naro and his two brothers. From here they ruled the greatest people since the dawn of the prime. Well alright then. I'm pretty sure here is the uh, apex of the Elder High Court. Boss time. He is a very moldy looking lad. He, uh, I remember his attacks being a little bit nasty, but we got an auto shotty, so we should be fine. Oh dear. Yeah, I'm more worried about the, the slow uh, that he does. Come on then. Honestly, this uh, version of the boss is quite easy, but you'll you'll you'll, you'll see uh, you'll see something special uh, after him, I think. Wow, great attack! Good job. Did a lot of damage. But yeah, he should be pretty easy pickings, to be honest. Not really much to say, really. Not not re really anything to go on about in his design. He's just kind of is. <laughs> I mean, the ice aspect is interesting, but he's by far the easiest of the uh, the three bosses. Could have used a shockwave. Yeah, he could have been much much more difficult. Like have uh, some interesting attacks and stuff like that, but as is, he's just kind of whatever. <laughs> I mean, you can literally just like pump in like a whole um, like two clips of grenades, and that's him dead. The ice, though, how he slows you down with that—that's interesting, but it doesn't really doesn't really reach his full potential. Skeleton protocol, council crusher. Well, there's an interesting uh, weapon we might go towards. And the Frost Claw. There's another one we might consider. We Open up, please. It's like the bloody King's Doors in Dark Souls 2. God, be quick! Right. Oh no, we don't actually have enough... Uh... Oh, fair enough, I guess. Now wait, I should probably compare it to this. That is just kind of better, really. <laughs> to put it bluntly, yeah. That's pretty good. That is pretty good. You know what? You know what? We're definitely going to go into this. Oh, we got plenty of basic components. We should have enough. No, wait. 4, 7, which is 11, then 12. No, we don't. But that's okay. We should be able to eventually. Uh, Stream Warden Inciter. I didn't really try that, did I? Shit. Oh well, not a huge issue, I guess. Uh, Frost Claw. It's special scaling. Again, oh dear. But it's critical is pretty amazing. Wow. And uh, don't let a burst throw you off on SMGs because burst SMGs are actually pretty great. Pretty damn great. You can farm them, but why would you? <laughs> I, I highly recommend against that. It is not a good idea because the, um, the drop percentage is so, so low. That there's just no point. There really isn't any point to it. 
but I guess it I guess it might be possible if you have um what's that item? Oh, hello, more bit canisters. Wait, what? Ah, advanced scavenger kit. Uh, it makes collection of bits easier. Increases the value of the kit. What? I'm surprised I'm not actually using those. They're pretty good. Awareness boost, basic weaponry, blah blah blah. And look how many uh, special weaponry things we got. It's like the game wants me to use special weapons. But I think that's just RNG screwing me over, really. Oh, well, uh, the reason for that is because uh, drops is so low. That's pretty much the only reason. <laughs> There's really no, no nothing more than that. I should have enough. That's still going a little bit over. But we... Wait, hold on. Let me uh, just double check. So I don't make a sausage of myself. Yeah, only one point away. Okay, lovely. Great, and we'll uh, likely go into that, maybe. I do like that assault rifle a lot. But I might, I might, uh, go into this. The Council Crusher. Ooh, Barrage. Oh, wow. Okay. The Inciter. Endbringer, which I'm not going to use. I guess we can just get rid of that. We're not using it. Yeah, at least we got some components that, that way. Um, I've got the Neophyte Night Hammer, so it might be, might not be worth it putting stuff into that. I mean, I kind of put myself into a bit of a hole here. Which it is my fault. It is my fault. Uh, we could probably put some in that. Some, uh, advanced. Not yet, but I do want to go in, go, uh, change out my stinky guns, uh, for those if I do end up replacing this with the shotgun. And we've also got this shotgun as well. Wait, I might replace it with that. Hmm. Hmm. And again. Hmm. Interesting. Oh wait, I don't have enough for uh, fast travel, do I? No. Oh dear, the, the 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 joys of farming. Oh god, this is your perfect game now, Craven. Farm all day long. Yeah, I know it's a shotgun. I know. <laughs> yeah it does I don't mind that too much though really because bits are so easy to get but um, it also stops your fast travel from getting all cluttered yeah it's probably because um, like I do love the idea of uh, having a shotgun it's just sort of um, varying up my arsenal for different types of, en types of enemies so yeah I'm just sort of uh, really thinking about it. Boing. I love that. It just goes a boing. So cute. Yeah, I'm pretty sure this is the one. Are you ready for an amazing surprise, Craven? And uh, other two viewers? Because I'm so lonely. <laughs> no, it's okay. I'm used to it. Oh, look! Hello, he's come back. It's like he never died. And he's also, uh... Well, you'll, you'll probably see it. Well, oh, no. Oh, dear. He's also much nastier. Which we might see. Yes, okay. Yeah. He's actually hard now. <laughs> so, no, I can't swap out the uh, the shotty with another shotty. That's not how actually how the um, the wet the loadout system works, because pump action shotguns are uh, secondary weapons, whereas the auto shotties are primary weapons. 
So you can have two types of shotguns. The primary ones, I mean the the auto shotties, you know, obviously have the the speed and all that. But the strength of having another uh, pump action shotgun is actually the the fact that it reloads one shell at a time, which can be very very useful. Oh wow, yeah, I just re real realized he's uh. Yeah, you actually can't damage him unless you hit the core. I guess that's something. Not gonna lie, this was actually- oh, oh yeah, I forgot about that one. Oh, mixing up his attacks way too late into the fight. Yeah, it's still basically the same strategy. <laughs> He just uh, hits so, so much harder. I actually, I actually struggled with that before, but no, that was actually quite easy. I guess it's because I've got a, a shotgun. Seismic hammer. Oh. Oh, interesting.